in this video, we are to do a soft brown liner makeup look. This look, um, I haven't done a makeup video in a while, so I was really so excited to do this video for you guys. So, for today's makeup video, we are to use products from ZC Cosmetics, which is a new artistic makeup brand. So guys, ZC collaborated with the British Museum to create artistic and really gorgeous, as in really gorgeous talaga guys, makeup collection like their Egypt Eye Shadow Palette. And their Alice in Wonderland collection. So guys, let me show you my top three most favorite products from ZC. Okay, so first is their ZC X The British Museum Alice in Wonderland Collection, which comes in three palettes. Okay, and then my second most favorite is their Palace Identity Dragon Lipstick, which comes in four shades. And lastly, my third favorite is their Palace Identity Peony Blush, which is a 3-in-1 palette. Alrighty, so let's now go ahead and start my soft brown liner makeup tutorial. Let's go. Okay, hi guys. So this is our blank canvas. I already put my concealer under my eyes and just on the spots that I want to conceal. So now I want to set my concealer with my ZC Reindeer Loose Powder. This is what it looks like. Can we just take a moment to appreciate the packaging? It's just so pretty. So let me just go ahead and um, put this. Uh, by the way, this is in the shade Jade or Translucent. There. Let me just get another palette for my mirror. Ooh, see how fine that is? Oh, shoot! Ooh, I like it. And it smells so good too. It smells so good! It's <laughs> perfume! Okay, so let me just put that over here. Let's put... Okay, let's put a little bit on my forehead because it's so shiny. Okay, so the next thing I want to do is do my brows and we are going to be using the new eyebrow pencil in the shade T01. So can we just take a moment again to appreciate this packaging? It's just so, so pretty. So this side, we have here the retractable um, eyebrow pencil. It's just so thin, guys. It can literally um, resemble a hair stroke <laughs> sa brows nyo. And then on the other side, we have the spoolie brush. Ooh. Okay, I'm just going to lightly fill in the bald spots or spaces in my brows. Ooh. By the way, guys, it also writes and lines very subtle. It's not like one stroke and it's so harsh. No, this is so subtle. Then let's use this pulley brush to just soften the lines more. I didn't really groom my brows, so we're going for a natural looking brows today. Okay. The shade T01 is so perfect para sa brows ko, sa brow color ko. So next thing that I want to do is actually take this again, <laughs> take the pencil again, and do my soft brown liner. Guys, I'm no expert when it comes to um, doing eyeliners. Actually, that's why I like the soft brown liner makeup look because the liner is not that harsh compared to the black liner makeup looks. Do you get what I um I hope I'm making sense but when you do like a soft brown liner it's fine even if hindi masyadong pantay yung two eyes mo <laughs> yung liner ng two eyes mo compared to when you use like a black liner it's so 
evident and obvious when you don't make it even but with the soft brown liner it's fine even if it's not that 100% even okay so I'm just gonna use the pencil again and line my eyes actually let me zoom you a little more you can see so I just go here's a lower outer corner where my you know I I ends and then I just extend it up <laughs> that once I have that I'll just connect it in and then I fill it in actually this is so easy to use because it's so slim and fine and I love the quality of the pencil it's not like the ones that break <laughs> when you when you line too hard Okay, I just try my best to fill that in. Okay, we have that. And we'll just do the same sa other eye ko. Actually, this is not yet done. I am going to darken this later with the eyeshadow. So, let's just do that later. And let's do my other eye first. Okay, so next thing I want to do to darken my liner is to take this um, Alice in Wonderland eyeshadow palette in blue or palette Alice. And we are going to be using this dark brown shade. Okay, so I'm just going to take a liner brush and use it to darken our existing liner. Same thing. Just go over the soft liner that we did. It's okay if we mess up a little bit. See, it went darker compared to this. It's kind of light. But this one, darker. Okay, also, if you ask me, bakit hindi na lang tayo nag diretso sa um, eyeshadow? liner instead of using the pencil uh it's because when you use the eyeshadow alone chances are it's got nothing to stick to if you know what i mean because this is powder and this is this has got like a pomade or pomade consistency like a waxy consistency so if we put this first the pencil first and then the eyeshadow, the eyeshadow got something to stick on. I hope I'm making sense. But actually, as you can see guys, I line, I did the line very smoothly. You uh, can't see any eyeshadow dust sa ilalim ng eyes ko. Yes, there's no eyeshadow dust because um, this eyeshadow palette is not too dusty or powdery at all. It's got like, I don't know what you call it, pero yung consistency niya, it's got like a creamy consistency to it. Okay, so let's just now do my other eye. Okay, also guys, this eyeshadow palette is so pigmented. That's why we are able to achieve this dark of a brown liner <laughs> just gonna take this random lash curler that i have and curl our lash and now let's take my zc living colorfully mascara and let's use the shade black of course but they also have it in two other shades which is red wine and aurora Two very, very unique shades. But for now, we will be using the black one. It looks like this. And let's just put that. Ooh! I love it. It's not clumpy at all. And it glides smooth, you know. It's like moist, moist. With mascara. Without. Let's put a little on my lower lash. 
okay so that's that for our eyes um next thing that i want to do oh by the way this is called the shine diamond washable colored mascara yeah my bad <laughs> okay next that i want to do is blush so we are gonna be using the palace identity peony blush this is what it looks like there this is another boji packaging so so pretty it also looks so unique because as you can see it's three in one so let's just use one of my um blush brush and ooh, it's just so fun to use okay let's just mix this two put this on my cheeks <gasps> oh wow this is so pigmented wait okay my bad wow this is so pretty ooh, can you see that wait it looks so harsh let me fix it Okay, let's put on both of my cheeks and let me just fix it later. But this is so pigmented. Oh my gosh. Ooh. And fix this. <laughs> okay, wow. I'm loving how everything is going right now. Oops. <laughs> Next thing that I want to do is put my highlighter. So um, this was the palette that I've been using as a mirror <laughs> since earlier. So this is the Shimmering Glow Powder Highlighter. Look, it's just so pretty. And I super love this shade actually. It's like a coral... Uh, type of shade I prefer this better than the gold looking highlighter for my you know my complexion and skin color so let me just go ahead and grab a brush like this and ooh, put this here wow oh, it's so fine it's not clumpy at all. Wait, is it that thing highlighter na ginagamit ko? It was so clumpy, but this one. <gasps> what the hell? It's so pretty. You guys can see me so sa camera. Wow. Oh my gosh, I love this. Okay, let's put on the other side. Wow. I literally have a new favorite highlighter now. Let's put uh, some highlight then under my brows and connect it to the high part of my cheek. Oh wow. <gasps> She's so blinding, huh? Oh dang. Girl, girl. It makes me want to contour my nose, but you know, in this look, I don't really contour my nose. But let me actually contour my nose so we can put highlighter. Send nose go. Okay, so to contour my nose, let me actually use the Egypt Eyeshadow Palette in the Geyer Anderson Cat Palette. I am going to use this because I found like a cool brown shade which I can use for my nose. Nose contour brush and lightly get that. Oh my gosh, it's so pigmented. I think I put too much. Let's start doing my nose. Let me just peel the mirror. It's so pretty. <gasps> oh wow, love this mirror though. <laughs> okay. Actually, let me mix this shade with this shade just so it's not too harsh. Okay, that's that. And again, let's take mm, the highlighter, the smaller brush. This one. To put my nose. Ooh. <laughs> Some on the bridge. <laughs> it's just so cute. 
let's now go with the lips we are gonna be using one of palace identity golden dragon lipsticks look how pretty this is and like the other products the packaging is so bomb <gasps> can you just see how pretty this is i'm actually turning into a gold girl now look i'm wearing a gold necklace you know i don't usually go for gold but wow this <gasps> turning really into a gold girl now so i'm going to be using the shade m10 or the nude apricot Ooh. it's like my lips but better and wow That formula though. Oh guys, I really love how it glides on my lips. Oh my goodness, I have a new favorite lipstick now. Oh my gosh, guys. Wow. I super love the finish and the color and what? Oh my gosh, it's not sticky at all! Oh wow, guys, the formula! Oh shoot, I have a new favorite lipstick now. <laughs> I'm just so happy. Okay, wait, so this palace identity golden dragon lipsticks. Um come in other shades too. I got sent three more, so they are the princess. Queen and reddish brown and the one I use is the nude apricot. So yeah, that's that So all in all I super love how the ZZ makeup products Turned out on my face super love how oh my gosh How we got this look from the ZZ makeup products and guys don't forget to check the product links of the ZZ products that I use down in my description box and you guys can use my code here that you can see on the screen for 15% off so this is our final look